What's up, everybody? Mexican. Currently in the Philippines now. We're getting a jeepney back to our Airbnb. We got on, but we don't know how you get off. Down the road, <laughs> like straight somewhere. First jeepney, just checking in. Current situation here in Cebu in the Philippines. We got in about 11.30 p.m. Had our first bucket shower experience this morning. That's surprisingly refreshing. From Kota Kinabalu where we saw you last, we flew to Manila and then we've flown from Manila to Cebu. But today we're actually traveling to Barian and we're gonna go check out the Kawasan Falls and it's where we get to do our canyoneering as well. But first we have to get there. <laughs> hello. Everyone here is super friendly. They just wanna say hello. I feel at home. So we made it to Cebu's South Bus Terminal. It's got to go to gate number 10 and then we can book our bus trip. So many buses! You can pretty much buy anything you want at the bus terminal here. Do we pay on the bus or are we meant to have paid already? I'm not too sure. Bit of a rush here, you pretty much walk straight onto the bus. It is so hot but this bus is so nice and aircon. I cannot wait, it's about two hours. We've been told that these buses leave every half an hour, so if you come here, you don't have to wait too long for the bus. Yeah, they don't actually leave on the half hour though, but they do bring little snack boxes around. Burgers, <laughs> There's two options that you have, or routes that you can take from Cebu City to Marian. The quickest one is via Barili, which means you go down, there's a little cross section area, and then you just go across where the other one you go all the way down to Oslo and then you have to catch another bus from Oslo. So don't get on that bus, get on the Via Barili bus. You also can't book the buses, it's just a first come, first serve basis. So just be here and if you miss the bus, don't worry, there'll be another one within half an hour. On the bus, the conductor will come around and he just goes crazy with his little clicker and he stamps holes in these little pieces of paper and then he comes around again to collect the money. But on here, he actually has a method to his madness of clicking and at the top, no circles so that's one seven zero. So in total for both of us to go to Buddy and from Cebu, it was 340 pesos, 170 pesos each. Kim made a friend. Yeah, people are really good at sleeping. Normally I'm the sleeper. Just checking in, we made it to our Airbnb here in Barian. Gonna go into town and get some dinner. Canyoneering is all set up for tomorrow morning, so we will see you then. Yeah. What is up guys? Our Airbnb host is about to come and grab us, so we're gonna switch you over to the GoPro mode now. Where you going? Do the first jump. This is our tour guide, but yeah. small group today. We got super lucky, so it's a half an hour walk till the first jump. Another stall with just some treats a uh, little while after that. 20 pesos, halfway snack, just in time for the big jump. <laughs>
That big jump there is it's from the top of Kawasan Falls. You're not allowed to jump off because quite a few people have died from doing it. There is one guy that our guide said he has seen do it and he was okay, yeah. but it's not worth the risk. They say it's 25 meters high. Wow. Wow. <laughs> from the canyoneering trip and it was honestly one of the greatest experiences we've had. So the rest of the day today we're just gonna relax, enjoy the sun and then tomorrow morning we're gonna go up to Osminia Peak. Yeah. Tomorrow. We've made it to Osminia Peak. It was about an hour and a bit journey on the scooter here coming from Barian and the roads are pretty good, pretty nice. It was on the right hand side of the road so that was a, another new experience and then once you get here you have a 20 to 30 minute trek that you just walk up to the actual top of the peak. The entrance fee is 30 pesos each. Yeah. So about a dollar Australian or just under. But check out this view. made it to our next destination, Lamborg Beach. <coughs> Sun's back in Kim's knees again. It's a real thing. It was about an hour drive back from Osmania Peak towards Barian. It costs 25 pesos for an entrance fee, which is just your parking charge for the scooter. And it's a pretty nice beach. I mean, you've got people playing volleyball, there's music pumping, you can buy anything you want here. It seems very locally, not too touristy. Yeah, not many tourists here at yeah. all. So I think we're just gonna relax for a little bit. We do have to head back soon and then catch our bus to Oslob, which is our next location. And there's only one thing you really do in Oslob. So if you know, you know. All right guys, that is the vlog. For the first few days in the Philippines, it has been absolutely amazing. Yeah, first impressions is probably that this is our favorite country. The people are amazing. The places that we've seen have been incredible and we are just so excited to explore the rest. If you haven't already, make sure you smack that subscribe button in the face. Other than that, stay safe. We'll catch you in the next one. Bye. This is Wesley and Eileen. They are the nicest couple here in Barian. Oh. If you're <laughs> ever here and you want canyoneering, you want scooters, you want, you want anything? Yeah, you want the best Airbnb to stay at. It's literally the best. It's like staying with one of your best friends. Yeah, it's been absolutely amazing. The link's down below. If that doesn't work or you want another way, just get in contact with us and we can pass your details on to them.